All right, so I'm going to talk to you about why I cut off 98% of all my friends. So I'm 17 in high school. So the friend group that I was surrounding myself with was full of people who would be on zero self-improvement. I'm talking no gym at all, maybe team sports, like whatever, team high school sports. But then other than that, it was drinking, boozing all day, smoking weed, vaping. The most pussy thing that you could ever do is vaping. Um, scrolling through TikTok and Netflix, you know, just like, just no, just all lazy people, just no self-improvement at all. So they weren't the best people to surround myself with, but period, that's it. So being around these people, you know, you kind of, you, you kind of act like them. So I didn't want to do that anymore. I was like, okay, I'm not going to, I don't want to drink. I don't want to smoke. I don't want to do any of this shit. And uh, thankfully I never got into like the vaping or anything, but, um, you know, so when I started to push myself away from that and go into self-improvement, uh, and I still am today, and it's still the process of when I'm going to the gym every morning and I'm sacrificing, like, staying up late, playing video games, or I'm sacrificing the weekends to get up early and work because I work. Uh, today I'm working eight hours because I have school, but most days I work eight to ten hours depending on the schedule. But besides the point is... I sacrifice to work and then go to the gym and just focus on self improvement overall. And they would just like make fun of me for it. They would, um, you know, they would, they would laugh at me and say like, Oh, you're wasting your time. You're going to regret this when you're older. And then like, if any of you know what trading is, I would, if anyone knew what back testing is, I was literally just looking at the market. So I was spending like eight hours just staring at a screen, trying to like, how do I understand this? How this goes here? Like it, it's a lot about trading and I don't expect you to understand if you're watching self-improvement, but, um, I wasn't making any money. So it constantly asked me like, Oh, how much money you make today? Blah, blah, blah. Like, like why are you doing this? You make no money. You're better off working McDonald's cause you'd make so much money. If you just do that, you're wasting all your time. So, you know, it kind of got to my head and I was like, I got to figure out if these are the type of people that I really want to be with like have a friend group with because if they're going to be constantly like just like shaming me for like trying to accomplish the goals and actually improve my life what's the point of even hanging out with them so this is the main part i want to get to so you know they always would say like um shit to me like like you should smoke a joint be a man just have a beer or something and it's haram first of all and um so i said you know what i thought to myself i was like you know what let me just spend one day. Let me not work for one day and hang out with them and just see what it's like. So I did. And here's how the day went. Wake up in the morning. First thing, like, I, you know, I hung out with them in the morning. First thing they did was fucking just go to like McDonald's, like legit McDonald's. And then they would just pound, pound beers, like vape all day long. And then the whole day, like, I don't even have to sum this up. The whole day was just drinking, smoking, no gym no work at all, just drinking, smoking, being lazy, watching TV. So I'm sitting there with this group of people that are supposed to be my friends and I'm talking about like, I don't even like talking about goals in front of them or I didn't because they would just make fun of me. But I, I was looking at them, I'm like, am I really gonna be the sum of these five people? Cause you know, you're the sum of the five people you spend the most time with. And I look at them, they're fucking bums. They're losers. And I realized all these people are going to be broke when they're older. They're just dumb. So I thought to myself, I was like, I got to get out of here. So I literally just left. And um, that was it. Like, you know, I'm I'm still like friendly with them, but I'm, I refuse to hang out with them. Like they'll ask me, hey, I'll beg no. Cause, and I'll just tell them straight up. And I hope some of them watch this video, to be honest, I'll probably send it to them because hopefully it will help them, you know. Uh, but besides the point is that I think it's very important for you to actually think about it. If you're the sum of the five people you spend the most time with and all your friends are out here playing video games, smoking, just no self-improvement, being lazy, like my friends were, most people in high school are like, most kids, then what are you doing? Because you're just wasting your time. You're wasting all your time. So what I did, and you guys, some people probably make fun of me, and, and they did too. I would be on Discord and they would be like, oh, what are you, some fucking Discord moderator? Like, you know, those, like, those geeks that, like, run the, the gaming Discord. I was using it just to network with people. And I still have, like, a group of people that I networked with. And I'll talk about uh, this guy named Jack in a second. But, um, so I was networking with a lot of people. And these are the people that, unfortunately, are not 
in like personally in my space but they're all over the world like they're all in uk europe budapest they're, they're all over the world but they're the ones that are my age 17 that have the same exact mindset and they're making 5 10k a month so those are people that i want to surround myself with but just because it's not in person it's a little tough but um yeah so i believe that if you're um if you're in that situation you should definitely try to get yourself out and just network trust me I was alone and had no like people in the same path as me for probably a year and a half. But then I found them through just networking and making these videos. If you make these videos, these will help you too, 100%. But I know I'm getting a lot off track here. So I want to say one more thing. So overall, I cut out everyone that was drinking, smoking, TikTok, Netflix, just no self-improvement and was kind of bringing me down with them. And now I found people that were online that were better and that, that keep me accountable accountable for my goals and working and then actually one of them we just we're going to close our first um, apartment in miami we're just going to sign the lease and we're getting an apartment in miami so you think age 17 those guys are out smoking i'm just trying to chase it so i can get this apartment so um you know don't listen to them just fucking leave them i just want to say that remember you're some of the five people you spend the most time with so don't spend all your time with bombs